Okay. Uh, let, let me just finish up uh, with uh, a, a few quick points. Um, as I was saying, we're 20 years removed from 9-11, and there seems really no basis to claim that sources or methods would be endangered by revealing this information. And if there are, the government should at least make that point. So far, it has failed or refused to do so. It has refused to provide any explanation or justification. So I went to the floor of the United States Senate last week. I'm going to be there again this afternoon. I encourage my colleagues to join me in the weeks leading to 9-11. And I encourage the families to do what they are doing today, which is to raise this issue as vehemently and vociferously as they can to arouse the conscience of the American people, because the American people should be outraged that their government continues to conceal this evidence and information without any explanation or justification to them. This cause is bigger than these families, even though it is justice for them that is immediately at stake. The Saudi government ought to be held accountable in court and in the court of public opinion if it deserves it. And the credibility of the United States of America is on the line here, which is a powerful reason to make this information public. All too often, we sit through classified briefings, and I ask at the end of many of them why the American people can't know what we've just heard. Documents are overclassified as it is in many areas, and in this area, there is no justification for continued secrecy, at least so far as the government has explained. Thank you. Thank you, Senator Blumenthal. In a fight uh, and in a legislative 